Hello and welcome back to Airline Tycoon Deluxe and our second episode here on Raw Slow Gaming. So our second mission or in our campaign will go to here we go, so to say. And we'll start it up and we'll see where we end up. And of course we will be Raw Slow Gaming with Falcon Lines here again in this campaign. So we'll see if this plays as easy or as fast as the first mission did. I highly doubt that, so we'll see if we manage to get the whole campaign in in this episode. But let's listen to the boss here a little bit. I'm curious to see who will be first to transport 2,500 passengers safely to their destination. Okay. Alright, so this time it's all about the same thing, but in a different manner. This time around we need to transport 2,500 passengers as fast as possible, so we'll try to do just that. So again we will take as many short flights as possible, and uh, preferably that are 180 uh, in capacity. So we'll take most of those ones and we'll check the last minute ones. And uh, after that, we'll check our schedule, what we can get in. Today, Madrid London, yeah, sure, should be fine. And there we go. So let's find up our schedule here and see what we can get in here early on in the game. So a lot of running around of sorts, but uh, not really either. So London, Munich is for today. And Madrid, London is for today. So let's get in London, Munich. Uh, Madrid, London first. And uh, let's see here, actually. Well, let's do Potsdam here. So we'll do the 180 flights that is until uh, Monday. So we have Dublin, London, and Brussels, London. And we are landing in London there. So it doesn't really matter. So we'll get these guys in as soon as possible. And this one is 180 as well. So London, Warsaw, we'll have there. And Bitfield. So until London, Berlin. So we'll have London, Berlin. After there. And then we'll have Copenhagen. London, that's actually decent. And we'll see if we can't get in anything else here on Friday. And uh, for Bitterfield, that would be pretty nice. Definitely not London Amsterdam for Sunday, sure, if we get that far. And the same for Paris, London. Also, London for Friday. I don't really know if that's good. Uh, it's kind of thing that it isn't of sorts, but it's 180, so we'll take it. So let's see here. So for Potsdam, yeah, we have more that needs to be put in. So London, then we are pretty full there actually for tomorrow with the Potsdam plane. And then we'll have uh, Oh, still nothing really useful here. So we need uh, something for tomorrow for a bit field here. As a first mission, well, on for the first task for us to do here, this first day in the campaign. So we'll definitely take that short flight. Madrid to London, we'll take that one as well. And that should be all right. And um, with all of those flights in, I think we actually have a very decent schedule here. Uh, so let's see here, Madrid, London. And we'll have PMI, London, and this is uh, a little bit tight, but there we go, Justin and Zurich, London. So. Bitterfield is filled up, uh, Potsdam could have one flight from London here, uh, that we do here, so could use a few more 180 flights for shortening here, preferably which are until 
so nothing there really and i actually think here that we should end off this day here i think we have made uh, made good progress here in this campaign uh, with the setup that we have done so far uh, we'll actually first check out the museum maybe this time around we can actually manage to buy a plane uh, would be nice so consumption there again ridiculous uh, for this Boeing 727-200 so a very old plane and a uh, very expensive consumption there in terms of fuel burn. Uh, so I think we'll skip it for uh, today. Um, I think we'll go with what I just said, ending the day here. Uh, or actually we'll take a look at the air travel board again here. So it's a little bit harder with the contracts being like this coming up. Uh, very small or what you should say not small I don't mean small but just a few at the time and uh, you got to be be advised to them so to say uh, but uh, it, it's part of the charm which with this game I would say that you got to go and check the boards and everything like that it's uh, yeah, it's 20 years old, so the mechanics were a little bit different, of course, but I still think it's it holds up and have a, have a charm with it. Uh, so after one day, we have uh, tra transferred or uh, flown 810 passengers, and this time around, our uh, opponents are very much closer with only airlines at 70, 20 or 7. 720 and sunshine at 630 so definitely a lot closer this time around or at least so far My information tells me you have transported this amount of passengers so we get the, the briefing again here in terms of numbers Until now, and the details here so let's listen to what he has to say about uh, uh, falcon lines so we have the uh, room to improve according to our boss here so let's skip this part here for now and uh, we'll go to the air travel desk here once again directly so dummy London yeah London Munich Yeah, that's basically what were good there. Now yeah, let's check the, the bit film board, Potsdam. All right, so we definitely need something for Potsdam here. Preferably actually for today. London Munich, definitely. It's a good fit here. Uh, Dublin, London should be able to squeeze this in. Yes, we are. And free first here. So we are clear for Bitfield. So we need 180 persons flights. We could do 90 persons flights, of course. But as I said, it's a plane that is able to load 180 or more. So we should be doing 180 flights or bigger. So could do London Athens. It's not that great, but I actually I think we'll pick it up because uh, it could use a, a, a flight for today, the Potsdam plane. I hope I didn't do this too bad now. Well, kinda, but not really. Kinda bad, but not really. <laughs> All right, so we need. Uh, one more flight for tomorrow for uh, Potsdam at least. So let's see here. Uh, tomorrow is Saturday. That's a too long one. So we do Berlin, London, and I think that actually will uh, sum up uh, pretty nicely with what we have. I do believe we have from Warsaw. Yeah, we do. And then we actually got from Syria to Luft. So let's actually turn these guys around. So 
so this should be much better. So we have now we can uh, could possibly fit one more flight in here uh, from uh, London tomorrow. So let's check for that. And uh, yeah, guys, if you are enjoying this, remember to smash that like button. Also hit that subscribe button if you want to see more. And uh, don't miss out on any of the episodes that we upload daily here on Raw Slow Gaming. So definitely taking Paris to London there for tomorrow. Uh, since it's what 180 passengers. Uh, let's see if we can actually get that in though. I don't know if that's the case. Paris to London, let's see here, Athens to London, so Paris to London should be able to do like that. And we'll skip here a little bit, yeah, and that looks all the nicer, can't push that unfortunately. So Bitofin and Boston both are all right until Sunday, so let's uh, see here, let's, uh, yeah, so we have uh, Let's talk a little bit, not with our opponents here, but a little bit about character design. So we have got an awful much of surgeons that are flying, apparently. And uh, we've got some hipster girl, we've got an uh, old lady and a dude that really likes airplanes or something. Or a snuck up dude said that they do want to get on holiday. Uh, but also likes planes and uh, yeah here we got our hipster girls again and uh, our old lady and here we have a real old dude that is uh, running away coming again here and uh, we have apparently apparently prisoners going around and cowboys and uh, some shakes sheiks or something uh, from uh, middle east so uh, a pretty interesting uh, uh, group of uh, passengers that we are apparently apparently tackling or uh, aiming at uh, taking <laughs> or aiming at taking out in the world so to say uh, that was again a very poor very poor English I could say that in a much better way and that's some nice animation there as well just waiting uh, with a uh, can't find the word for that either in the English, but uh, yeah, swing time by there with some nice pause animation, so to say. And actually, I see they're very uh, actually animated that uh, that girl that I said were uh, what did I call call her? I don't remember. Well, hippie or something like that. Uh, actually animated uh, the movement of uh, the body on uh, that woman, which is interesting. I don't think I saw animation on anything else uh, other than uh, well, the, their feet, really. But uh, on uh, that character, it was something else uh, that were moving as well. And I won't get into details more, so we'll just continue to the next day here, which we just did. So after two days, we are up to 1620 passengers and still are pretty close by this time around from Hong Islands at 1332 and Phoenix Travel at 1300. So Phoenix Travel doing a really great day yesterday, actually. So let's see what the boss have to say today. So let's listen to the details for us. So again, again, our airline is average and can improve for sure. And uh, our personnel is average. Planes is good though, so that's nice. So let's uh, check the air travel agency here again. And uh, this is basically what we're going to do at the moment. So a lot of flies there with only two person, personal persons. And that would be very good if we were looking for profit. But uh, today we are looking for transportation, transport as many passengers as possible. So only 
really one order there that were any good at all for us. And that were London, Amsterdam. So let's see here if we can't get that in uh, like that. And let's see here, flight planning for Potsdam. We need a little bit more for Bitfield. We definitely need a lot more for tomorrow, actually. Yeah, we'll wait. So let's see here. Uh, until Wednesday, yeah, that's good. Monday, Saturday. Now I want for Sunday. Copenhagen, London, it's all right, but not great. Last minute is close today. That's uh, that's not good at all, actually. Let's uh, get back in and try to plan in those flights that we did pick up here. Uh, so Copenhagen, London. I said not really great at all. Uh, London, Palma de Mallorca. We can do for Potsdam. So Potsdam is full for the full day tomorrow. Between not so much. So really need to find a. Uh, a few good flights here for uh, Bitfield, London, Vienna, uh, Frankfurt, London. Can we can combine those two? That should be a pretty good uh, combination actually for Bitfield. So let's see here, London, Vienna. Let's do London, Vienna, and let's do. Let's see here. Frankfurt, London, uh, London, Amsterdam, Copenhagen, London. Uh, with that setup, I think we got a good, pretty good here. So we can see if we can add in anything more for Monday uh, for both flights. Let's see here. There we go. So both. Both our aircrafts could do with the uh, Monday fly flights. So London, Dublin, yeah, that's fine. And Dublin, London, don't think we will be around until uh, that date, but uh, we'll get it in here nonetheless. So let's see here. Dublin, London, yeah, definitely not going to happen that we are not reaching two and a half thousand passengers before on Tuesday, but uh, that's all right. So London, Dublin, getting in there, fitting very nice, actually. Uh, let's see here. So here you actually can click one of the things in the office that we haven't gone, uh, gone in with, so you can uh, yeah, actually have uh, the ability to buy fuel when the fuel price is low and you can use it in your planes and save money that way and uh, yeah the tanks are empty planes will be filled at market value so actually you can troll your tank depot from here and uh, you buy fuel somewhere well from petrol air of course you buy fuel so let's uh, check that out. And uh, as uh, don't provide something else as well. So that's a little bit of a secret that we might get to later. I don't remember the secrets at all, but there are actually quite a few secrets in this game. Uh, we'll ask how's the kerosene business. And uh, here you have... Uh, also, three different types of fuel. You can have top of the line that uh, give extra boost, but that cost crazy much money, and some normal fuel. And then you can buy really cheap fuel, but that's going to ruin your planes. So, I don't really want that. But uh, let's see here. We, let's uh, tank on this here. Let's buy, let's say, oh. Let's say a thousand barons, maybe. How much is that? Yeah, that's 100. No, I said a thousand barons. Can't buy more than 100 barons, apparently. No, oh, 100 barons is maximum, so let's buy everything. Uh, let's see here. Let's check if I can buy more now. No. 
No, it can only hold uh, 100, 100 sparrows maximum, apparently. So. Let's see here. A lot of two passenger flights again. First London, I don't know if I can get that in, but we'll check. Probably not, so we get a penalty on that one, but that's all right. Uh, let's see here, Paris, London, Vienna, Frankfurt. No, can't squeeze that in there, but Paris, London, we actually might be able to do it here. Yeah. So squeezed in, Vienna, London, then. Yeah, we'll not get to here either or even later there on Tuesday. So we could go for uh, Saturday Monday. We are Monday flights, I guess. On the Warsaw. And uh, Sunday, I'm thinking long No, I don't think we have room for it. Monday, but maybe that one that I plugged in, yeah. London Warsaw on Monday is all right. Uh, but not really since it's a 90 passenger order and uh, should have more for Potsdam, but uh, apparently not. So we'll call it a day here and we'll see if we manage to get up to two and a half passengers and not really apparently. So we're reaching 2,340 passengers here after three days. How many lines that? 18.72 Phoenix travel at 16.42. So closely, quite closely followed here, but not as close as before. And apparently there have been a sabotage this day or last day. So let's see what the boss say. And uh, yeah, it's been a cyber charge at uh, Honey Airlines from uh, well, the Blue Airlines. I don't know uh, what they are called at this moment since I pressed it away. So you can see it uh, by the ring over their head who were doing that. So let's see here. So the numbers are still pretty clear and uh, we are leading Sunshine Airlines is what the airline that we're sabotaging for uh, Honey Airlines was called and uh, our reputation is still okay but we should work on it and uh, condition is good and personal is average so there's a lot of different values that you can try to alter and get better at here in, in this game and we'll do that throughout the game but uh, here actually we are uh, pretty much done with this mission i think because we have planned until nine o'clock for tomorrow for potsdam and for bitfield as well so we will win the mission finishing the game right here so we'll press tab and call it a day here uh, very early because uh, we will win the mission not getting too much in there so finishing the mission here at 3330 passengers moved and honey at 2180 and phoenix at 2002 so in the end we win uh, by 50 percent over uh, the, the transit passengers of our closest opponent, but in the start it looked like it were going to be a lot tighter, but uh, apparently not so much in the end. And there we have it, mission accomplished or accomplished. Yeah, accomplished. So that will again be everything for this episode after completing the mission so in the next episode you will see us take take taking on the next mission and we'll see if we'll do it as effective and as fast that time as we did this time so for today thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time here on the channel and bye bye you have been watching rose Glow gaming and i hope you have enjoyed on clicking on the video on the left you will see the next video in this series and on the right our latest upload to the channel and with that 
said thank you again for watching.